Okay, Hannah, what's for dinner? Oh, I want to have milk, Dad. All I want is milk. Okay, fine, you can have milk. But you know what we're going to have? Mom and I are going to have some shepherd's pie. Yes, we are. There's three levels to a good shepherd pie. Mashed potatoes, which of those will become. Corn. And a good hamburger mix on the bottom. I prefer onions, mushrooms, and brown gravy mix. Alright, so we got the uh, mon mushrooms and onions sautéing right there. Um, I chopped them up in kind of, you know, that size chunks. You can do whatever size you want, small, or just leave them whole, whatever you want to do. Uh, but I like them that size. And then we got mashed potatoes going back there. Uh, what's good about this is that usually the time it takes to sauté the mushrooms and onions, cook the hamburger in there, get the gravy going, is about how long it takes for the mashed potatoes to get done. So, timing works out pretty well usually. And, uh, so next we're going to throw in the hamburger and the gravy mix, get those mashed. Alright, there's uh, the mashed potatoes. Um, you can make them however you want, just, you know, I, I just use milk and butter and whip them until they're creamy. Uh, you can do whatever you want though. Um, Alright, so we are on to assembly stage now. Alright, so we got our pan here. We got our base layer, which uh, this is the hamburger and gravy mix. I've also thrown in some garlic, thyme, and oregano. And then we got second layer, corn, top layer, mashed potatoes. Okay, so we've gotten the easy part done and starting on the hard part. You've got the bottom layer, it's got all the hamburger and gravy mix, and then you got the corn. Next we're attempting to put in the mashed potatoes without messing everything up and stirring it up. So what I've been doing is just taking out of my bowl here, throwing down a spot, throwing down another blop, repeat, and then once you got a big chunk of on there, covered a good area, just kind of start spreading it out. This way you uh, can get all the mashed potatoes on to the thing without mixing all the layers up. Alright, so we got mashed potatoes all on there, nice and spread out. And now it's oven time, so we're going to take a big old dish and shove it in the old oven. Whoop. Need to clean that out. But uh, we're going to throw it in the oven 375, just long enough to heat it back up, so probably another 20 minutes or so, half hour probably. What do you think, Hannah? Does that sound good? Half hour and dinner will be ready? Yeah, I think so. Hannah wants to have dinner. Yeah. Mom will be home soon, then you can have dinner. Yay! Alright, there it is. All done. We've got some bubbling up on the edges. Right there. It shows you got nice and piping hot. Now we got to do is wait for the wife to get home. And there it is, the end product. Beautiful shepherd's pie. Even Hannah thinks so. Beautiful baby. <laughs> Hannah approves. Hannah approved dinner. Yes. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> I love shepherd's pie. I love hearty casserole style dishes where everything's all in one. Stews, hot dishes, casseroles, shepherd's pie, lasagna. Anything like that's all one big hearty meal. Bam. Love it. Okay, so we did the easy part, which is uh, laying down the layer of hamburger and putting the corn on top of that. Okay, so we've done the easy part, which is put down the layer of meat and gravy and putting down the layer of corn. Okay, so the easy part's done, putting down the layer of meat and gravy and the layer of corn. Next we've got to put the mashed potatoes on top of all that. Uh, and we're going to toss it into a 375 oven for a half hour or so to heat it back up and get everything all nice and toasty. Just like the Hannah likes. Hannah likes nice and toasty food. That way mom has nice and toasty milk. Yay! There is the final project. Shepherd's pie. That's the final project? <laughs>